What's going on guys, James Yanish. Welcome back to the YouTube channel. I hope you guys are having a great night. Um, today's video, we're gonna be going over a little bit of a Q&A, some questions that you guys asked me on Instagram, all that good stuff. Just about like, you know, what got me in the gym, all that good stuff. Why did I say that twice? But look at this chicken right here. That's what got you into the gym? The chicken? Mm -hmm. Yes, the chicken got me into the gym. But I hope you guys enjoy this kind of a style of a video. And then, you know, tomorrow, we're gonna go hit a little bit of a late day there at Crunch. Test that out. It's not going to be as good as Prodigy, but that's all right. Still going to have some fun. Got a cool hack squat, squat, all that good stuff. But, yes. So, thank you, baby. Okay. Rate this Christmas tree, boys. All right. This shit's actually kind of cool. Well, it's missing. Well, things. it's missing a lot of things because, bat, where you at? Hello, sir. Where the fuck are the ornaments at? <laughs> where are the ornaments at? What did you do with them? <laughs> we place them, replace them here on the bottom, but even up here we're missing quite a few. He's literally been taking off all the ornaments and picking them up. He's literally carrying them around. Even like the big ones now, he, he like takes them off and picks them up from right here at the top. So, and he's been playing with like caps and shit like that now, so you know, we're evolving <laughs> in the games of bat. Yes, my head is a little itchy. But actually, we I just got back from a uh, Broncos game. Shout out to Coach Carl. If you're watching this video, he uh, hit me up this morning. He's like, hey, got some uh, Broncos tickets. Not going to be able to make it today. Do you want them? They were actually really awesome seats. Down, I think, row 110. Literally 12 rows off the field. So they were insane. Uh, even though the Broncos suck ass. So, <laughs> fuck the Patriots. Jonathan Taylor, let's go, baby. MVP of the NFL. So like I said, a little bit of a Q&A. Um, just some, you know, get you guys to know me. Somebody brought that up. Louie, if you're watching this fucking video, thank you. You know, so. There's not much to know. Not much to just know. <laughs> yeah, first question. What got me into bodybuilding? All right, so, I mean, a lot of different people have like interesting stories and all that stuff, but honestly, mine's pretty basic in a sense of high school football, so. Obviously forced to really go work out in the mornings and at first I really hated it. But <laughs> like you know, like early morning workouts, especially as like a freshman, don't really like working out, tiny, weak, you know, I just feel out of place a little bit. But we'd have a go like we'd have uh, our workouts at like five in the morning. So shout out to my grandpa. He would literally drag my ass out of bed and tell me I have to go work out, even when I hated it. So then I kinda slowly evolved into, you know, liking working out. Um, at first it was just more like football workouts, so obviously power cleans, all that good stuff. Um, more cardio stuff all the time. But then, you know, I kind of evolved into the guy in the corner, curling. Well, our coaches would yell at me for power cleaning. <laughs> I actually got yelled at for that once. For so, what? so we're in the gym at like five in the morning, we're supposed to be power cleaning. Uh -huh. And I was curling. <laughs> Instead of that, I was literally in the corner fucking curling. So I got yelled at that, yelled out, yelled. Yes. Yelled at about that. <laughs> started watching Bradley Martin and started just liking the process of just bodybuilding, wanting to look better. And then, you know, really kind of wanted to start filming. And that's kind of takes me to the next question of um, what got you into YouTube? So that literally, like I said, started out with Bradley Martin, um, Dylan McKenna, David Laid, all that stuff. I like the style of videos where like, I want to watch it, like I mentioned before, while I'm eating my breakfast before my, you know, gym sesh, my pre-workout meal, kind of getting motivated, but also more of a vlog style. I was in college um, for a year, and I remember Jade, she was literally like, I was, I was like really stressed out about school, um, school wasn't for me, it was pretty much pointless because I was going there for personal training, and I remember Jade was like, hey, um, why don't you just work out for a living, and I was like, how fuck you do that? <laughs> I was like, well, why don't I start a YouTube? Because I've always kind of wanted to do that, but you know, I was kind of more embarrassed in the gym and stuff like that. So the whole point of that story, literally just, if you want to start a YouTube, start a YouTube. You want to take pictures in the gym? Who gives a fuck? If you want to flex in the gym, who cares? You know what I'm saying? It does not matter. Um, just do what makes you happy and all that good stuff. Next question, do I want to uh, compete? So I'm assuming that's bodybuilding. Um, but yeah, so I do want to compete in bodybuilding. I kind of want to, towards the end of next year, I need to find a coach all that stuff um but yeah i actually really would like to compete helps get your name out there um i like the competitive side of it because i've always played sports and all that um but yeah and if i when i do compete i want to compete in classic i'm not the biggest fan of uh men's physique because i love training legs so what's the point in hiding that with men's physique 
as okay. well. Okay, so the question is from Jade, is fitness modeling something that I would want to do? And yes, in a sense of like, that's what sponsorships are going to be like. Exactly, but like what you do, photo shoots and stuff. Yeah, exactly. So like, that's what I think is really cool about Gymshark and Young LA and all those brands is they get all of the, uh, the sponsors and stuff all together, like expos and all that, and they do photo shoots, all of them work out together, all that cool stuff. So it's a lot of content, a lot of like meeting people, like-minded people um, with the same goals as you, and you just get to collab and make a lot of cool videos, cool photo shoots, all that good stuff. Next one, uh, favorite music in the gym. I listen to a lot of stuff, but in the gym, honestly, I like hard rock a lot. I don't like screamo, but kind of on the verge of that for like, especially my heavy sets. Um, I also like some rap, but more like, I mean, it goes both ways. So NF is like one of my favorite artists and kind of like that, like, it almost brings out like an emotional side in you, which I like in the gym a lot. Um, that slower, not even slower, but just like shit that kind of pisses you off, which I like a lot, but also just like your basic rap for, especially like arm days and stuff like that, like five finger, um, Slipknot, stuff like that. Even some like early 2000s rock, like Three Day Grace, all that good stuff. Favorite body part to hit? Okay, this is hard. Right now, I don't want to sound like a basic bitch, but probably chest, just because I've been having really good chest workouts. Oh, so chest is basic bitch. It's literally basic. Like if you look at every frat guy in the fucking world, what do they go hit? Chest and arms and that's it. But I do love the grind of legs, obviously a lot. And I love training legs and I really love squatting. But then again, back and bicep is literally like the best workouts ever. But right now, probably chest, my go-to. But overall, um, probably legs just because of how big of a grind it is. My right, favorite cheat meal? Pancakes. Pancakes, yours? <laughs> Jay's favorite cheat meal is pancakes. <laughs> Even though you have those all the time. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, mine, how do you go against Chick-fil-A? Nah, I, I'm not a big sugar guy, so I'm gonna go Chick-fil-A on the favorite cheat meal. Um, well, like two spicy chicken sandwiches, some chicken nuggets, large fry, lemonade. I guess that kind of like stems into the competing and YouTube side of it. But, so yeah, so like I said, I wanna compete. Um, if I really like competing, then I wanna continue to compete, obviously, and see how far I can go in that, if I enjoy it. Um, like I said, first one, I'm gonna take super serious and I'm gonna do good, obviously, but I kinda just wanna test the waters and see if that's something that I really enjoy and like. Um, but then I also wanna go deep, obviously, into the YouTube um, and all that stuff. And my end goal is to own my own gym one day um, and just make it like everything that I want. But I guess my main goal is for uh, working out and bodybuilding is I wanna get like YouTube. That's my main goal. I really enjoy making these videos and just like motivating people, bringing myself out, um, vlogging, bodybuilding, all that good stuff. So main goal is YouTube. And then like I said, competing on top of that, pretty much everything, sponsorships, YouTube, all that stuff together. And then literally the end goal is owning my own gym one day. Um, probably in Colorado. I mean, I do want to open one up like on the beach of California. That'd be so sick, but I don't know. We'll just see where that takes me. That's going to wrap up this little uh, Q and A that I did. I might do another one. I just need to get some more questions. Um, next time, maybe a little more personal with just, you know, more random stuff. Thank you guys for the support recently. I want to get to 200 subs very soon. I'm at like 175 right now, which is actually kind of cool. That's really good. That isn't bad. I've gained like, you know, in the last couple months, over 100. So I appreciate every single one of you guys who do watch these videos and who do sub. So just know that I love you. All right, boys. So just pulled up the crunch. It's not going to be any prodigy or anything like that, but um, just going to go try a leg day at crunch. I saw the hack squat. Didn't look too bad. So I think we're going to hack at leg press, obviously. Um, and then just kind of see what else we can do. RDLs, um, extensions, all that good shit. I don't know if I want to squat today. I guess we'll see when we get in there. All right, boys. So I think I'm going to go, um, I'm going to squat first and then go into the hack squat. Um, just kind of trying out today. It feels really good though. Maybe a couple top sets, four or five. We'll see. Yeah.
No love, no love from me Yeah, I can show nobody fake love Cause I've been in my bag lately Getting cash, baby So don't you act like you been here from day one Graduated from a simp, turned into a big ball Now she see me getting rich cause I'm about to take off Yeah, my life is like a movie, this is only take one Hey, and I ain't got no time for no one with fake love Where the love go? I don't know, but I need something that's for real She just want designer red bottoms in the hills, California She just want the lime like go, go digger She gon' see me when the time's right Heard that little bro was trying to play me Heard he talking crazy, now he coming to congratulate the kid I think it's funny how they try to hide the hate And be the first to smile up in your face and show you all this fake love I can't stand the fake love Where the love go? Where they go? Where the love go? I can't stand the fake love Where the love go? Where they go? I can't show no love, can't show no love No love, no love from me yeah, I can't show nobody fake love Cause I've been in my bag lately Getting cash, baby So don't you act like you been here from day one Graduated from a sim, turned into a big ball Now she see me getting rich cause I'm about to take off Yeah, my life is like a movie, this is only take one Yeah, and I ain't got no time for no one with fake love Where the love go? Tell me where the love went She don't care unless it benefits her budget And I can tell she only in it for the gold She gon' have to learn to get it on her own Tell me why the boy was talking on me like he was sweet Then turn around and try to doubt me when we up in the street I can't show no love for a hater, a traitor Showing fake love, see you later, later I can't stand the fake love Where the love go? Where they go? Where the love go? I can't stand the fake love Where the love go? Where they go? I can't show no love, can't show no love Alright boys, so just got done with that uh, late day here at Crunch. Honestly, wasn't too bad. So I like the hack squat a lot. It felt really smooth. Um, I like the depth that I could get on it. it felt really good. Um, like I said at the beginning, I thought I was gonna be feeling stronger on um, squat because I felt good at first my first couple sets, and then once I got the 365, wasn't just feeling that strong. Um, it was just more of a groove. I just didn't. I, I don't know what it was. Just wasn't feeling real strong today. So I only hit uh, 405 for a set of three there at the top. Decent three, not bad at all. My second rep was pretty fast. Um, yeah, just haven't really been feeling squats too much lately, which kind of sucks because I absolutely love them. Um, I don't know. We'll see next week if we can get back into it. I want to hit like 405 for like sets of six to eight around there. Um, we'll see though. But like I said, crunch wasn't that bad overall. I'm especially just, you know, coming here just to get um, more content for you guys. Switch it up a little bit. I know that the same gym can get repetitive and stuff like that over and over. Um, but yeah, so like I said, we're getting real close to 200 subs. So if you guys have any more questions for that Q&A or anything like that, drop them down below. Um, help me get to 200 subs. I'm going to do a little bit of a giveaway at 200 subs. I think what I'm going to do is... Uh, do like an entry and stuff like all that, but uh, the winner will get a pre-workout of their choice by an order for you. Um, but yeah, so help me get the 200 subs and we'll do that little bit of a giveaway. Thank you guys for the support once again. I really do appreciate it. I love every single one of you guys. Have a great day. Deuces!